Good morning guys and welcome to today's video. Today is a party day. It's party day. We're getting ready. We've been up early. The thing about when you have to get ready for a party and you have a farm, you have like hours of chores to do before you can I'll do the, the party. Stuff. Anyways, I have to tell you guys this story really quick before we get uh, on with today's video. This farm, this farm has always felt so spiritual to me. Like every time I wish for something, it's like, it's like I said to God, God, this is what I want in a farm. And then he showed us this farm. Like, and then every single day I'll be like, I really wish we had a bench here. Poof, I find a bench. Like every time I wish for something, it comes true. So we have pear trees on this farm. We have one that's not really good because it's planted in the shade. And then we have another one that's in the sun and the deer come and eat from it. And it's amazing. We're so grateful for it. And then the other day I said like, I wish we had an apple tree here. And then what happened? We had an apple tree. <laughs> come, let's go see. Sam was cutting the grass last night, like he does. And he finds an apple tree. And he doesn't tell me, he tells Sophie. You were in your room. Oh, I was in bed already. And then there's apples. Watch out. Clearly oh, it's a bit overrun. There's a bunch of apples down there. Yeah, but there's apple tree. It's not like awesome. <laughs> but oh, if we pruned that. away and cleaned this sucker up, oh, we could get some really nice apples. Eventually we could get some. Like we haven't even explored the front yard yet. There's another garden here, a whole garden that has so many treasures in it that we haven't even, oh, sorry. No, I like that red one I just found. We'll try They're it. They're not ready yet. This one fell, fell. Anyway, fell washed and cleaned up. These are so good for horses even this year. This is a good apple. Yeah, that's a good apple. When things happen naturally and everything seems to fall into place like it has with this farm, it's meant to be. And if you're like fighting constantly and trying to like force something to happen, it's not meant to be. So I wanted to share that with you guys so that if you're fighting for something and it's just not happening, maybe it's time to let it go and try and find something else. But look at this, what's that? That's an old plow. It's a tractor thing. Yeah. Anyway, I should clean, I wanna clean out, I wanna get out here and clean out oh, all these gardens. I wanted to share that with you guys and explain that sometimes when God says no to something, it's because he has something so much better planned for you. So if you're really sad about something that you really, really want, just remember that God has the whole plan in mind and he knows really where you wanna be. And if you're really struggling trying to get that job or that guy, just, just maybe God has something better planned for you. So we are home from shopping. I bought a bunch of stuff. These are Gabby's favorite snacks. She asked me to pick those up for her. And we are having a pulled pork for dinner. We do this thing with the garbage every time we leave the house so that if the dogs are free, they don't get in the garbage. Sometimes two of them. Ruby and Molly will sometimes knock this over and then make a big mess if we put a chair over top of it. We do the deaf dog would be the best ever. Yeah, the deaf dog doesn't do anything bad when she's out of the crate. Okay, when we leave her accidentally out of her cage, she sleeps all day. Yeah, she just sleeps. One thing I hate about this house is this floor. I hate this floor. I don't like that one much either because it's so light. But this one in particular, I don't know if you can see, but it's got a grain to it. Like it's it's grainy. And dirt just gets trapped inside there. I literally washed this floor already this morning and it is filthy. Like the dogs bring stuff in and it just looks awful all the time. It's disgusting. But one thing I love about this house is this bathroom the reason i love this bathroom so much is that one gabby keeps it pretty clean she's a, a clean person but it's right inside the door and when people come over they can just always use this bathroom which is super handy because then i can lock the dogs all the way <laughs> over in this bathroom it can be a mess if it needs to be a mess. Sophie's doing her makeup. It can be just like awful and nobody ever has to come in here. I can put the dogs in here. I can close the door. The dogs don't even hear that there are people here. So if we were having like a party, like this party will be outside. So they'll be outside with us. But if I was having like a bunch of kids here and I was worried about the dogs jumping up or, or just getting too wild and too rough, I could put them in here and they wouldn't, they wouldn't care. They'd just rest, huh? 
You're always gonna have something that you don't like and you're always gonna have other things that you do. Mostly we love this property. We love everything about this house. I didn't even know I was gonna like it this much. It's, it's, it's been a miracle. Even though I got this front porch all set up pretty for the party, I haven't really been out here a lot. Uh oh, it looks like something got on this couch. I'm gonna have to wash that. Anyway, I'm excited to use it tonight. This is the blanket that I got. I didn't show you guys. I got it from Indigo. Um, it's like a bookstore. It's small, but it's so super soft and fluffy. So this is our very first party at this house. So we're just noticing all the things that we need to like change or that work or that don't work. The dogs are enjoying a run. <laughs> Ellie is noisy. At the old house, we had a, for this fridge down in the barn, but nobody wanted to go down there. So like it was too far to go down. So we didn't ever, so we didn't keep all the drinks in there. We put all the drinks in a cooler like that with ice at the front step on the front porch. But now that the barn is so close, it's just as easy to stock it full of drinks and let everybody come in here so they're not going in the house. But we got these drinks yesterday at Costco. I think I showed you, Warhead Sour Blue Raspberry Soda. <gasps> it's so good. We didn't get a chance to show you guys the end result of the coop yesterday. So this is what we ended up with. This is the only way we can put this thing in here for safety because they jump over everything. We didn't want them jumping up on that back wall and falling through. <laughs> because when we were in here, one of them did that. <laughs> The one that I love. Yeah, so we ended up moving that there so they couldn't jump out the window, they couldn't jump out. So it's gonna make it even hard to build like little platforms for them because they'll just jump right out the door. One of these little bugs was in my eye. Yes, yeah, so last night we came down, we moved the girls to their new house and then last night we came down and they, a bug flew in Sophie's eye and it was awful. She woke up this morning and her eye was all swollen. Is it better now? Yeah. It still it's looks irritated because the bug fell out. I still see it all red. Did you just rub it? No. Oh. Anyway, it was like a big mess. They cleaned the poop off it. <laughs> they cleaned the poop off before they lay on it. Boots are so cute. They're so smart. Last night we trimmed everybody's feet. <laughs> and it was interesting. Who gave us the most trouble? Tilly. Tilly, so that little white mama back there. We finally did manage to get her. Oh, look, they're just all laying down. All right, so this is something I don't get. Why do they do this? Do you guys see? They all do it. Four of them were doing it. They're all like grinding their teeth or, or maybe they're eating. See, all of them, they're all doing it except for the little boy. And the little boy is really the cute one. Okay, so uh, you guys know we have a bunch of people coming over. Um, I wanna show you guys where they're gonna sleep. Oh, <laughs> that's close. So we're gonna set this up with some lights so that it's like this cute little camping area. We have extension cords, we have everything they need. They can even open all the windows out here because they're gonna sleep in the trailer, but they're gonna sleep in the trailer in the barn. And if it rains tonight, we can have a little party in here. I think some of them are here. All right, so we have some little kids here, my nephews, actually my niece's kids, so that's my second nephews. And we're exploring the secret hatch in the barn. <laughs> These are the first people, I'm surprised, J I'm surprised Jacob didn't go, actually Jacob wanted to go down there and I said no. <laughs> I'm like, I'm not really into that today, but you, you these guys are exploring Wait, don't, it. Don't, don't, don't. Yeah, everybody's worried about Ellie. Because Ellie is kind of crazy. Do you know what Ellie does? She swims in the water trough every day. She swims in the duck pool every day. Yeah, wait till you see them. They're really sweet. Well, we're going to do some videos tonight. We're going to explore. But... Look at the trailer. I left the I left the light on in there, and it's so super cozy. We're gonna undo it all like the. the haunted mansion from the new haunted mansion. <laughs> Great! Just where we wanted to live, the haunted man mansion from the new haunted mansion. All right, there they are. They're down there. Now, how are you getting back up? That's my question. Oh yeah, I'm coming back up. <laughs> 
But you know what's weird about this farm? I just have to tell you this. Every time I say, oh, I really want to find, I really want to make this, I find it. Yeah. I said two days ago, I'm like, I really wish we had an apple tree because we have a couple of pear trees. Yeah. Yesterday, Sam finds an apple tree. <laughs> I'm like, I really want a bench in this barn. And Sam's like, all right, well, I'll try and make you a bench. I literally turn around five seconds later and there's this nice bench. I'm like, well, this bench will do. So I was, I was telling her like, that every time I, like this is a good view here. Every Never did I think we'd ever find people climbing out of the barn. Um, every time I want something, I'm like, oh, I really wish this farm had an apple tree. Because we have pear trees. Yesterday, Sam's fi Sam finds an apple tree. Does he? Yeah. The other day, I'm like, I really want a bench for this barn. I literally turn around and five seconds later, I'm like, oh, there's a bench. <laughs> It'll do perfectly. What the heck are these things? Is it like to hang a pot over top of fire or something? So Sophie and I just discovered that last week. See that door right yeah. there? Go open it. I've never seen it open before. But we're walking along and we're like, hey, there's another door, <laughs> another gate to the barn. I'm imagining, does it open? I think it's boarded shut. Oh, I imagine it's like for a hay tractor. You yeah. throw your hay up here. Chance asked me, is the goose a dinosaur? <laughs> Look, pet him. He's so, you want to hold him, Danielle? Yeah, but he sounds like a dinosaur. <laughs> he sounds like a dinosaur? This, isn't he nice, though? He's, nobody can catch the duck. The duck is a girl. Sophie had her last What the heck is, are the horses doing underneath there? Come here, Ellie. I might as well carry you. They're like, which ones are the bad horses? Ellie, get over here. If somebody scoops her up, that would be good because... Horses don't like her. So all you have to do is just be aware that they get excited when they see people and they come running. So just step to the side. That's what I do. Does that mean that she don't pack them? No. But it can that feel... Oh, yeah. No, she's she's a baby. She's like a tiny baby, so she doesn't know all the rules yet. Oh, me! <laughs> I'm not scared of anything, they said. Yeah, Chance has said a hundred times today, I'm come not scared of anything. Look, the horses are looking very threatening. <laughs> the, the, no, it doesn't do anything. Oh, it's no, it's there. Sam's cutting a path everywhere down there for us. She's a baby, so she doesn't know any better. I think it's time for your No, they, they're nice. You've seen all them. You've yeah, you've, you've ridden these horses. <laughs> There's Sam way over there cutting a path for the kids to ride. <laughs> all right, are we all settled down? Everybody's feeling brave now? Yeah, can you go? <laughs> <laughs> Aren't you going to ride the horse? And then this one's nice. Yeah, yeah there's flies. Look at over there in the corner. I spy two lovebirds. This is new. Uh oh, Penny's in heat. One, one, one! I've been there before. I've said run, run, run before. I don't need to run, I need to walk. Yeah, because you're brave. <laughs> Just do a Finally, an animal you're not scared of. <laughs> Why the bravest one goes on the. Um, <laughs> yeah, it sucks to be brave now, doesn't it? Yeah. Why? What's Cancel? wrong with it? Nothing. Nothing. He's, bigger. he's, he's bigger. just bigger. Okay. And we know Landon. Yeah, he's calmer, actually. Yeah, I like them. You guys have been on them. Yeah. You guys have ridden them. I put that one. You moved to a different farm, and then suddenly everybody's afraid. Yeah, I'm not. <laughs> Good. I forget. All right, so we are already up. Did he get up easy? Yeah. This guy just hopped right on. So the horse is going to move all around. It doesn't matter. You just sit there and hold your horn. And they like to go on trails. All right. Look how comfy it is. We told him to lean back going down the hill. Isn't it comfy? I can see his face. He's got this huge smile. All right, I gotta run ahead. Welcome to Narnia. You got a smile that makes the sun rise. You make it shine. Storm only agrees to go on trail rides if we let him eat the grass. <laughs> it's his thing. Gabby's tried her whole life to get him to not try and eat grass, but he does it anyway.
another part of the farm I have never been at yet. That's our horse's field right there. Ooh. So this, no, that's somebody else's yard. So this is actually the end of the property. Like over there, it goes to the road and it goes all the way back to another road. So what'd you think? Good. Was it long enough? Yeah. Oh, good. <laughs> what'd you think? Fun. Was it fun? You gonna ride again? Yeah. But I can see that you don't realize And that's what made me fall in love Cause you We are waiting for the rest of the people to get here. I'm cooking dinner right now, but I wanted to show you guys the mushroom. I wanted to show you guys the mushroom. I'm gonna cook it. I cut it up. It's super spongy. That's really cool. I'm gonna fry it in butter with some onions, but this is what it looks like. It's actually so super cool. Like this is it's so spongy, and but it tastes so good. It's like very fleshy. It's like so thick. I see here you got my favorite licorice. You got licorice? We never It's also licorice. Willow's favorite. And that is our pulled pork. Wait, I'm gonna try it. Don't you know that you're beautiful?